Now the next step in programming our fuel tables is going to be entering in our injector characterization data. Now that means that uh, we're going to account for that lag time that we talked about in the other EFI basic videos. Now just to do a quick refresher, the lag time is going to be when we command the fuel injector open from our injector driver from the ECU and until the injector actually opens and delivers fuel, that lag time needs to be accounted for. If we do not account for that, we will not deliver the correct fuel mass in our fuel mass uh, to injector pulse width calculation. So to get our corrected uh, uh, pulse width, our total effective pulse width, we need to characterize this lag time. Now we're going to see in this table here, we're going to program our injector latency or offset or dead time, depending on what you want to call it. Um, it's going to, we're going to po populate this table with values based on different voltages we're going to operate our injector at. 